We back. I'm I'm here. <laughs> she with me this time, y'all. We yeah. in the bed together. Yeah, we getting a little to... cuddle time. It's been, I feel like I haven't been able to be close to. Her. Yeah, we moved to a um a a, a nice room. A postpartum room. <laughs> it's nice. <laughs> like a hotel. It's nice. <laughs> I'm gonna give y'all a tour. I'm gonna show y'all my room. Well, not if you don't have to at this second. I'm gonna give y'all. I'm gonna give y'all a little tour. Look, we got meals tonight. First oh, of yeah. all. Do y'all hospital give y'all steak and shrimp, baby? Mm-hmm. With a baked potato a and a salad me. and a cheesecake, bro. And it took me to the snack section. There ain't no vending machine, G. It's free snacks. All you want. I ain't gonna eat them, but all you want. I was just shocked. It's super. This hospital is super nice, and I didn't give you a tour of the other room. The other room's nice too, but this room. It's not. It's like a sweep. <laughs> I got. I can shut the doors, even though I can't. But I'm not going to. But you can shut the doors. It's got a little refrigerator. Yeah. A little desk area if I want to do some work. They got two TVs in here, so I she want to watch own her own TV. TV. I'm like, dang, they want us to be separate. We supposed to be making having a family in here. Oh, my baby can't be over there. I know. Safe. It makes me sad that he's not in here, but he's I doing well. He's doing well, and I'm doing well, so that's good. Doing better than last night. Definitely, so I'm happy that you're doing good. I'm finally a little chippery. She was looking out, out of it and sad yesterday. I felt bad. It was a long night. Yeah. Those medicines had me out of it. I, I was like felt woozy. 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 This morning was kind of tough, too, because she had to, like, finally get up, and they took out the medicine. And when she came down, you know, we had to try to move, and she had moved, what, two days? Like, her legs, they was weak and heavy. Yeah. Um, and trying to, like, they didn't even make, try to make her walk at first, just get out of the bed, and she was having a tough time. But, um... Just her, shaking. Yeah, her legs and her body was just like, I was like, dang, you Okay. I don't know if we need to do this. I know you want to see the boy, but... I was determined. God. I was like, I'm going to shake all the way down the hall <laughs> if I'm going Shake him like a stripper. Because I was going to see him. I'm like, it's been, what, over 24 hours? Yeah. I'm like, y'all going to get me down this hallway. Facts. As soon as they was ready to take that catheter out, I was like... She was like, I was taking a nap. She was like, are you ready or you want to sleep? I'm ready. Yeah. But we just want to give y'all a little update. I'll give you a little room to it. We'll insert the video. But, uh, oh, we're going. You said we did skin to skin? Oh, yeah, I, I, oh. I told him. Uh, oh. we did skin to skin earlier. I get to do it later, so I'm super excited. So, uh, I get to hold him for a little bit. He was a bit squirmy. I don't think he liked it at first, uh, because it was different. Like, mm-hmm. he had only been laying on his back and. Nobody had been around, but and nobody had been holding. You know, he doesn't get to be held, so so he was kind of like, uh, and then it was hard too because of his little um, CPAP machine. It's big, and so I think it, he couldn't get comfortable because like it kept hitting, and I, it was, and it was. I think it was weird for us all because we want to be careful. He's like super tiny, it's like it feels fragile, even though yeah. I'm sure it's okay, but. We just don't want to do anything wrong. And he had all those wires on him. So, um. You told him how big he was? Yeah, my boy was 3'7. But he was 3'6 today. He was born at 3'7. But he weighed in a little a little less today. But, um, he's feeding well. They just upped his milk. So, we're about to get big. You hear me? Big. Yeah. And <laughs> we've been pumping. So. Yeah, pumping been going good. Yep. Everything been going pretty good, considering that we came in here and, and, and in a traumatic it was state. Very, yeah, it was very scary. I did not record nothing because I just felt like it wasn't the time. We recorded on the way over here, but then things just kind of like all of a sudden just, just went downhill real so quick. So it was kind of scary. I was super nervous. Um, Both of us were, so it just it was a lot. Yeah. But I'm glad um, they have an awesome team at this hospital. So I'm glad that uh, we had the people that we had 
they they made us feel comfortable even though it was still a bit much but um they got our baby here safe they got my baby back and feeling better she's feeling pretty bad for a little bit but yeah um, i'm still on meds but not as much as i was on so i'm still they're still monitoring his blood pressure because it was acting crazy but even still today this morning but i've been taking the meds and now instead of the iv meds i'm on oral meds so that's that's better that's way better you're um, still setting my hooky back up so you need some fluids yeah which i'm i'm fine with just well just fluids <laughs> but the meds i'm taking the meds orally now yes baby got yeah, my back feeling whoops i'm feeling too good but uh, we're going to get back with y'all. We're going to try to enjoy our dinner. We sit, I'm sitting in the bed with us so we can have a, yeah, a, romantic, we got a, we got a little a little romantic dinner tonight. <laughs> a little romantic hospital dinner. Mm -hmm. But all right. We'll see y'all later. Peace. <laughs>
be without the mask. I feel so bad for him because then he had to have the mask on like and it. he under the blue light and they got all of that stuff on his face mm -hmm. and he doesn't like it today. When they took it off, he looked so happy. He was like he calm. He was just so calm. He was looking around. He was like, yeah. What y'all doing? he was mad when they put it back on. He was pissed. But I, I, he doesn't know it, but it's to help him. So he'll be okay. It's not, nothing that's hurting him. It's just bothersome, of course, if you had something over your face on. Because even I had the oxygen over my face that one day with him, and it was bothering me. So, and he can't pull his down. So, I understand. But it's helping him, keeping him where he needs to be and helping his lungs get better and remembering that they need to breathe for him now. Yeah. Um. And then, but he's been eating good. Yeah, he, my boy. He went from oh what two mil two meals the first day to thirteen to thirteen now. And so, it's only been three days. Yeah, so he's been three been, days old. And been he getting eating. that milk. He's been eating, eating. Six, my boy. Six. And he long. He a little yeah. long. Everybody keeps saying he's so long. Yeah, he lost a little weight though. He was born at six seven. He was six, yeah, six, seven at three, seven. I mean, three, seven. I'm sorry, three, seven. And then yesterday he was three, six. Today he was three, three. But that mean that means that he's lost all of the extra fluids. Yeah, and so, now he's about to build up, you know, good baby fat. Yeah. So, so in we'll the next see. couple of days we'll start seeing his weight increase. So that's what you know what we want to see from him. Um, just excited to we're about to go visit him now and just excited to be there with him for a little while um while he's he 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 knows our voices because he gets to moving and shaking and grooving when he hear us talking so he's like i know that's my mommy's for sure mm -hmm. but i mean it's been nice being here honestly I, yeah i told you we told y'all this was five, five star five star service here we in my room right now i invited her over <laughs> i said you want to come sit on my bed or what you can come on over here if you want to okay and make sure you lock the door <laughs> but effort. but we will um we'll be down there for a little bit and then we're going home tomorrow. Yeah. It's like so, bittersweet. Yeah. It's like one of those were like, I want to go home and lay in my own bed because I miss my pregnancy pillow. Not her pregnancy <laughs> pillow. She took one of my pregnancy pillows. Got two of them, man. At first, I was like, you don't even need that. But now she need it. But I do need it because let me tell you, my back be hurting. I be sore. I be like, man, I like to put it between my legs. I be like, who we? Yeah, so we that's both that old need. lady. I'm tired. I miss it. I've been laying yeah. on this little cot over here. And I'm like, man, where my it's pillow not, at? It's not even uncomfortable. But we, um, we, you know, my blood pressure has gotten to a point where it's stable enough. They're going to just keep monitoring me. I want to keep, I want to have a little bit more doctor's appointments in the near future. Um, just monitoring blood pressure and make sure that it, it doesn't go crazy once I leave this hospital. Because I'll be on meds um, at least for a month. And then, you know, we'll go from there. But I'm sad. It's like, yeah, saying we want to go home, but I'm like, I'm. We have direct I'm, access to them. We don't have to drive. You just walk down the hallway, and then there be is. Yeah. But the good thing is, is you can come here and stay as long as you want. So I can come after I get off of work and stay to 12 if I wanted to. Yeah. So that they don't put time limits on the parents um, visiting their NICU babies. And so I like that. But we're also at a smaller hospital, so um And it's and they have private rooms. Like sometimes people have like uh like more than one baby in a room. So, you know, you can't have all those people in there. But the rooms are private. So when we go down there and as long as they're not doing anything uh with him and uh checking him then we can sit with the door shut and just chill, look at him. Yep. Oh, we've gotten to like hold his hand and yeah, uh, touching T skin to skin, 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 skin. I haven't got to because he got jaundice. Yeah, hopefully, um, um, hopefully one day soon she'll be able to. Um, I want to hold him. Yeah. I got his little uh, huggy right here. I know. I so got him. Get our scent. I got one too. So can't wait to we'll, get it. We'll give it back to him when we go back to him. <laughs> We'll go yeah. give it back Talk to him, him baby. <laughs> and he it stays in his bed with him so he can smell us. Um, but 
but he little too, so I ain't gonna yeah. lie to you. I'm a little nervous. She held him and she looked nervous, and I was like, because he's like super tiny, even but though. But it's more so nervous because of everything that's CPAP. attached to so him. I hope by the time I get to hold him, baby, he got it all. Because yeah. I was like, baby, if he and he move, he be wiggling, and then like it hits your thing, you know, like your chest, and it was like I was like, ooh, boy. Like, but also the one he have now is a little different than the one he had yeah. um, before. So, but. We'll show y'all a little bit when we get down there and just, you know. We'll see. We'll see. But we we'll, just wanted to update y'all. Yeah, we'll be back. We'll we'll be back when we get home. Yes. So, see y'all later. Peace. We're going to change a little diaper. Yes, no, we're back. Ever. Mm -hmm. yes. He knows something coming. Look at him moving around. You decided to change some butt? Yep. <laughs> yeah, I'm about to get it in. Let's see. Let, let's see if you actually... And it's funny. Some things, like, don't bug me. Like, I can listen to the same alarms and stuff all the time. Mm -hmm. But there's, like, two sounds. Like, all the different things. We have two sounds that make me absolutely crazy. Yeah. And the one when we thaw milk in a milk warmer, it sings that little song, but it does it, like, on a loop. Oh, ugh. And it makes me want to, like, throw the milk warmer off the <laughs> It probably would make me want to too. Um, and then the feeding pumps, when they're done, instead of like beeping, yeah, they, it makes like that alarm yeah. sound. The first time I was in there, I was like, oh uh -huh. God, what happened? Yeah, I'm like, that is a panic level of a sound. Like, yeah, it is. It's going to freak parents out. That, I feel like the feeding sound should just be a, a calmer just, sound. Yeah, it should just be a beep. Like, hey, it's done. Yeah, Not yeah. like freaking out. Yeah. <laughs> He's just staring at you like, this lady crazy. Yeah. Bounce squats when you get home. Do some bounce squats. I have no idea what that is. I know, leg day sucks. <laughs> 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 I know. Oh, you prefer? Arms and back, right? Well, you gotta do legs. You can't be strong without doing legs. Hey. It's so bad, though. Look at me like, oh, leg day. I was like, I know. No. You don't